Today, we are going to tell about our project. Our project is energy resources and conservation. Today, we are going to introduce three energy resources. The large conservation of energy states can either be created nor destroyed but can only be transferred from one form to the another. This is a dam. This is a turbine connected to the generator. The water from the dam flows fast from height with huge force and rotate the turbine. The turbine connected to the generator generates electricity. Here, water energy is converted into electrical energy. This generated electricity is used for industries and household purposes. The water from the dam is also used for growing crops. Next is wind energy conservation will be explained by my teammate. Here, wind energy is converted to electrical energy by windmills. Windmills are mostly planted in open space where wind flows are more. Windmills have wind turbines and generator. So the wind turns the wind turbine. The wind turbines are connected to the generator. The energy produced by the wind turbines is converted to electricity by the generator. This energy is taken to our use by the transformer. This electricity can be used for factories, farms, streetlights and household purposes. Next is solar energy conservation will be explained by my teammate. This is the solar panel and this one is its controller. When the sunlight falls on the solar panel, the electricity is generated. In our project, I am going to explain three uses of energy obtained from solar panel. Firstly, this energy is used to pump underground water and the water is stored in water tanks. From there, crops are irrigated. The second use is for running street lights. The electricity is stored in batteries and used at night. The final use is for domestic uses. The solar energy is used in houses for various purposes such as running, air conditioners, television, etc. Thank you.